What's up guys? I got it here. Two boxes, Maryland Blade subscription um, box. This is level 2 100. And I also left the KOTM by Maryland Blade. There's another one. So I spent $200 on two boxes. Level 2 and uh, like a knife club over here. So let's see first one. I opened it up already so that way it's easier. And I got it here $100. Demco knives and this is so nice I did 20 and this is the production version of a custom knife by Demco if it's a custom knife it's a couple thousand dollars or at least like eight hundred dollars I don't know last time I checked this one uh, made in China so like a Chinese version cheaper AUS 10A steel made in Taiwan I'm sorry Taiwanese version um, so Shot lock, shot lock, it says MSRP, $150, but I honestly seen them everywhere for $120. So, it is a really good knife, so $100 knife, actually a very nice surprise. It is really hard to find them for $100 knife, and it's a, such a nice um, everyday carry pocket uh, knife. There you go. Very skinny, very big blade, very fidgety. There's uh, different ways to open, even this way. It just wants to open. Once we kick it, even spider, of course, is a lot harder to open this way. This one is just satisfying. So, super happy with this club. Still, they continue shipping high quality items. Look at that, there's a replacement. Uh, for the whatever you call it clip so definitely recommend this one um only like 24 dollars um come up not a 50 dollars so it's not bad it's good at least it's quality knife if you guys into that kind of stuff especially if you collect them you probably know how to resell them because you don't want unless you like made with money uh you want to sell some knives for profit so it's paid for itself. Okay, now subscription box. Operation 88. Monthly subscription box. Alright, and pull it up. A lot of stuff. Only paid hundred dollars for entire box. Right away, we have right here a $20 item. Maybe more. Let's scan it on eBay and we're going to type in everything into calculator. Right away I see some good stuff. 400 bucks seems to be going to be a nice little profit right here or like a good deal i would say not a little profit a good deal so we have right here they go 15 dollars used plus five dollars shipping this is used pre-owned this brand new 35 dollars so we have a new one so 35 dollars all day so we'll call it 35 dollars but let's see amazon sometimes have a really good deals on kind of like Knives like that because this is like a folding knife, uh, money holder, clip. Man, Amazon is having some glitches. Wow, they like destroyed my phone over here with their glitches. Let me close off a couple of my ups. Okay, so what I do is get a barcode, and looks like Amazon does not want to scan. That's hilarious. There you go, finally. Come on, I have a really slow internet because the hurricane and I'm in the basement so I have a really slow service. Let's just take a picture of it. Now, Amazon is just not working anyway. So we're going to pull up uh, prices off of eBay. So this is going to be like what? I'd say $30 medium, medium price. I would pay $30 for that easily. It's per new. Okay, next. Let's drop down this side here. And put that to the side okay zero tracks uh, sand eliminator oh that's cool that's something very unique uh, for the car Whew, I have a couple of kids you know three kids to be exact and um, yeah the diapers the food on the floor the snacks on the floor uh, and I have dogs and I had to put my dogs in the car so three four dogs three kids two adults and drive all the way down to florida man 
that is kind of all over the place so that is another pretty expensive item how often does it sell that is the question also a big time question is how often does it sell is it a good item is it a nice sell to rate and if we scan a uh, sell to rate man it's so slow my internet is so slow and it sells so really nicely that means it's just a good item if it sells a lot if it's a whole bunch of listed and nobody wants them that's kind of like a filler item to me this is a filler item so we'll just give it another like what 25 dollars so 55 okay maze oh man i don't think i ever have that personal maze so i do have a ton of bears and during a hurricane we couldn't take trash out or anything the bears did came out and knocked over my, my trash cans so this is might be a good idea to have it when we go hiking camping things like that protect that from the animals um, looks like we're gonna have a really slow internet now i might have to kind of go pause it oh no way we have another knife in the box I, another sog no way this is by sog i seen something like that but there was a different brand so either sog have collaborated with them man this is what i like about barrel and blade they have name brand stuff so this is looks like 15 dollars 15 dollars so we go plus 15 so we had 70 dollars remember we paid a hundred there's still a lot of items a lot of cheap items but that's okay um this is why they have different subscription for 100 dollars but one item for 120 dollars i kind of like it more because i just have too much junk so let's see we had 70 dollars let's see if it's gone oh man my internet is so slow i might just have to skip through every time i need spacex so bad man while it's thinking let's open up another one. Oh, look at that uh extendable spring button this one is not coming up so i will try to do amazon it's just a new item i think let's take a picture of it seems to be probably will be working better if i take a picture this is a duck pry so it's a pry bar uh, compound okay there's and on top of it my phone about to die but yeah while this lodging check this out button oh man look at that that's hilarious never seen anything like that this is kind of quality usually those things are so hard to deploy this one works really well it's probably like 15 dollars as well i wouldn't give this thing more than 15 dollars probably would never carry one of those but if you're security guy while it's loading let's see what else we have this is some kind of oh this is nice ar-15 like a mouse pod that's cool this is probably like 15 dollars just a mouse pod um while this ebay amazon loading what else we got is there this is nice safety glasses a tanker it's probably another 15 dollars easily 15 30 dollars oh man look at that this is perfect for survival situation winter is coming bring it with me snowboarding a skin that's nice and one more item this is the targets shooting uh, targets that's probably another like eight dollars okay after scanning it all i get a little bit better service on a surface not under the basement they said here was 21 dollars uh, so that's nice but still a bunch of cheap stuff uh, the most valuable item is like 30 dollars in this case even on the level two right here 25 dollars 40 dollars zero tech vehicle pro device zero trace so i uh, actually was cheaper than that so the most expensive some uh, weird item and then a sog um fly xu it says 30 but i found it on amazon for 20. so it's a little bit uh like msrp prices but there is uh, a lot cheaper items for amazon so i come up to like 185 190 
uh, dollars a whole bunch of cheap stuff so if you're interested in the subscription um bunch of little stuff under 40 under 30 dollars they go in i'm in this kind of stage of life to where i'm trying to declog i want to have more expensive items uh, over 100 200 dollars only items but uh one item instead of like 20 items uh, under 20 dollars because this side here easy to sell for 100 bucks this side here kind of harder to sell and shipping is going to be more expensive so if you that kind of person would rather have one quality item for over a hundred dollars this 125 dollars i would go with that subscription box if you want to just get a bunch of cheap junk uh they go you can go with that subscription box just two different items i still like it because we only pay hundred dollars and i got it uh, back a hundred and um what is it? $185 worth of stuff. So I could sell it all in a lot for $100 and get my money back. Maybe $125 pay for shipping and fees and taxes. Boom. But yeah, definitely way better box to just grab one of these items. Unless you really do need these items and you can keep few things, sell off few things. I do enjoy this subscription box and I do love it that they give us two different uh, styles of subscription box for those people who want only one item but quality item or a bunch of cheap ones. That's super nice. So anyways, thumbs up for me for these both subscription boxes. Keep it up, uh, barrel and blade. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.